Okay, so I thought I'd make one last video of the uh, modifications I've done here on my 2014 Nissan Leaf in order to add a extender H pack in the trunk comprised of 18652 batteries. So one thing that was very important to me was uh, to have to make no modifications to the car itself so that everything could be returned to factory original. So the primary uh, function here this is the original cable that's coming from the front of the car so that goes to the inverter or the charger um, try to mold plug everything so it's actually simply two cables um, they're about uh, one out zero size um, I added some tape here just to, to protect it even better they actually it's just um, it's funny it's electrical tape orange electrical tape they put all over here so there's a protective loom it's a plastic loom uh, over top of it and there's a, a, a met, met, metal screen for shielding I'm assuming and this is the plug which comes apart by pressing here pulling back and then at a certain point you have to push here to continue pulling all the way back that unlocks it and you can take it off so this normally connects or this one is connected and you can see they're actually exactly the same so what I did is I purchased off of eBay a person had bought a uh, scrapped leaf for, for the batteries and were uh, parting off everything else so I bought the cable so basically this part and the receptacle this part that goes on the battery the plug from the car comes in, plugs into the receptacle that, that I, I put in, then the metal uh, bar that normally would go into the battery was cut, I spliced it and connected it to the, the, the plug that, like this, the plug that uh, I purchased. So like, it's a, essentially it's a very short extension cord, but the reason for that is for these see there's two cables here so that's my tap off so I teed it off here these are four gauge um, welding cables they're probably overkill because I'm not gonna be pushing that much current through them uh, it's funny thing is I actually wanted six gauge um, there was a special at a hardware place uh, that I go to it was called Princess Auto here in Canada the uh, it's like sort of like Harbor Freight they uh, had a special on six gauge and it was really really cheap like a dollar fifty a foot uh, it was, I can't believe how cheap that was it was less than half price but uh, strangely enough when I went there and they cut me a piece it was actually four gauge <laughs> so yes here we go so the connection here I crimped it and soldered it real good and then um, with the tee off the uh, then I plastic dipped it so I must have put 20 coats of Plasti Dip to be sure that it's all insulated properly. I also put a bit of uh, Mechanics caulk, uh, glue, which is like caulking, silicone here, just to make sure that there's absolutely no way the water can get in. Um, so that's it. So if anything ever happens that I want to take, sell the car or I need to bring it in for warranty work, I just simply have to disconnect this, disconnect this, take this part out, plug this back in and we're done. The cable here, surprisingly there's quite a bit of room between the battery pack and the uh, the body of the car. Here's tons of room. Uh, that's the tunnel to go to the back and then some ways behind there this is where the disconnect is. Then there's the hump on the back seat but still I was able to run the cable through, fish it through uh, fairly easily. And so that's it. This is the, the extent of the modifications of the car. There's a plate here, that a plastic plate that will cover all this. So once it's in place, you won't even be able to see that there's any modifications. So for normal warranty work, that's for the front of the car or suspension, whatever else that needs to be done. I won't even bother moving it. Only if it's a major, like let's say the batteries go bad and I have to replace, get the batteries replaced, which I highly 
doubt it it's a 2014 um, those seem to be lasting a lot better and I'm in here in uh, Canada it's fairly cold here and uh, the only reason I have I want to put an extended pack is I want to extend the range just a little bit um, but uh, we'll talk more about that later